one of NTSB's senior hazmat investigators today to begin to look at the cargo and the cargo manifest. Uh, he was able to identify 56 containers of hazardous materials. Uh, that's 764 tons of hazardous materials, mostly corrosives, flammables, uh, and some miscellaneous hazardous materials, class nine hazardous materials, which uh, would include lithium ion batteries. Some of the hazmat containers were breached. Uh, we have seen uh, shear on, or sheen, sorry, sheen on the um, waterway. The federal, state, and local authorities are aware of that. We were able to confirm that there were tr 21 crew members on board the vessel at the time of this accident, plus two pilots.